Mabuhay! I am going to discuss order of operations and our learning target for today is to use order of operations to evaluate numerical expressions. Why is it important to have rules when finding values of expressions that contain more than one operation? At this point, we are going to start with the key idea. A numerical expression is an expression that contains numbers and operations. When you evaluate a numerical expression, you find the value of the expression. When evaluating a numerical expression, use a set of rules called the order of operations. These rules tell you the order in which to perform the operations. Order of operations. First, perform operations in parentheses. Second, multiply and divide from left to right. Third, add and subtract from left to right. Let's take this example. Evaluate 19 minus 18 divided by 6. Using the order of operations, divide first, then subtract. First, you have to divide 18 by 6, and that will give you a quotient of 3. After that, you need to subtract 3 from 19, and that will give you an answer of 16. So, 19 minus 18 divided by 6 equals 16. Let's have another example. Evaluate 30 divided by 3 plus 7 in parentheses times 2. Using the order of operations, perform the addition in parentheses first, then multiply and divide from left to right. First, perform operations in parentheses. 3 plus 7 which is 10. Second, divide 30 by 10 and which will give you a quotient of 3. And then, multiply 3 and 2, which will give you 6. So, 30 divided by 3 plus 7 in parentheses times 2 equals 6. Let's have a recap about this lesson. When evaluating a numerical expressions, we have to follow and abide the order of operations. First, perform operations in parentheses. Second, multiply and divide from left to right. And third, add and subtract from left to right. This video was requested by one of the teachers, and I am happy to share it with you. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Maraming salamat!